You know, we opened the conference yesterday with the terms red hot. And uh, I think that describes what we're experiencing here is, is business people are getting together to explore just what God has for them in the marketplace, how they can impact uh, their world for Christ and how we can help equip them for that. Uh, there, there's a tremendous excitement. There's a tremendous sense of, of uh, Peter used the term, and there's a great term, undergirding. That people feel like there's a foundation being laid for them now to go back into the marketplace and live for Christ and live out their identity and begin to win uh, the folks around them to, to, to the kingdom. Actually, I think it's farther along here than it is in the States. Uh, partly, and as I mentioned to some folks, I think the, the battle lines, if you will, are much clearer here. Uh, and the States are quite blurred. And so it, it's a little bit more guerrilla warfare, if you will, over there. But, but here, I think the, the Christians, uh, they don't say they are if they're not. Uh, they're committed. They're serious about their faith. And so it's much easier to equip them to be active in the marketplace. So I really do believe that the, the energy and the focus of the business's mission or marketplace ministry movement is, is, a little more, is a little sharper here. My main message has been seamless integration. Uh, the, the message that, that all of us have a, a high and holy calling, regardless of what our gifting is, uh, whether it's business or, or ministry or whatever, we all have an equal calling before God. Uh, to live under the Lordship of Christ and to do it in a, in a, uh, a world of equality, egalitarianism, um, together winning people to Christ. So people who might be considering coming to a future CREATE conference, what would you say to them? Find out right now where and when the next CREATE conference is going to be for the simple reason that we have almost 200 people here this year. I think we're going to see two or three times that number next year uh, as people begin to understand that as business people they can come here, they can be equipped, encouraged, challenged, blessed. Um, I, I don't know where we'll have it that will hold that many people. So uh, go to the website and find out where it's going to be. Be there.